I was surprised to read it, given all the things that you do. I can't believe your mother once told you you're an underachiever <laughs> because you hadn't gotten your master's degree. Yeah. You came from a family of educators. Tell us something yeah. a little bit about, about the environment in which you uh, grew up. Yeah. I, my You're an underachiever. I'm the underachiever. I am the disappointment in my family, let me tell you. I come from, uh, my, I, there's four girls in my family, no boys. Uh, I'm the youngest of four girls. Uh, my mom has nine sisters, so I had like nine aunts. It was just like no men in our family. It was all women. They were all educated, all independent. Um, they also, most of them were teachers. A lot of them were educated. My mother was a special education teacher for 30 years. And uh, yeah, I, I was on Desperate Housewives and it was the number one show in the world. And my mom was like, well, you know, you don't have your masters like your sisters. <laughs> and I was like, okay. Uh, and so I, she guilted me into going back to school, but I actually went back to school to get my masters during Desperate Housewives. Um, Between takes, you'd do homework. I was. About and I would ask the crew for help with my homework, like the cameraman. I'm like, well, what? explain the new deal to me, you know. Um, and uh, it was a lot of fun. It was all encompassing. And I, now looking back, I, I was like, how did I do that? But it was important at the time because I, um, crazy enough, when, I don't even, when, when was this? When did I get my master's? 2013. 2013. So uh, six years. <laughs> <laughs> so seven years ago. And I wanted to know more about immigration because it was such a hot topic. And I said, I just want to take a class on the history of immigration, specifically for Mexican Americans. And, uh, and that class grew to another class, which grew to another class, which made me uh, enroll in, in getting my master's in Chicano studies. And I thought, oh, this is such a pressing issue. And then to, to be where we are today with that issue is mind boggling and, and um, disappointing because I really thought like, oh gosh, I've got to hurry up and understand this because I want to help fix it. And, uh, and here we are, it's, even, it's just a, more of a mess.